Golf WRX Tour reporter Andrew Tursky. And I just got back from Napa, California for the 2022 Fortinet Championship, where big equipment news was going down for the start of the PGA Tour season. We had new products no one's ever seen before, big names switching into new products we've never seen before. And of course, legendary Golf WRX photographer Greg Moore was out there taking a million what's in the bag photos. Let's get right into this week's recap. First up, we got Ricky Fowler making a big iron switch to kick the year off. Throughout his career, Rick's almost always been a blade iron user. Do you remember the Rev 33 irons he used a couple years back? They were some of the most intimidating irons I've ever seen at a dress. That's changed in a big way. Ricky showed up to Napa with a set of Cobra King Tour cavity back irons that we've never even seen before. When Golf WRX caught up with Ricky for a PGA Tour video, Ricky said he tested out new Cobra King MB, CB, and King Tour irons. He said he went with the King Tours because on miss hits, he was only dropping about four to six yards instead of seven to nine yards with the MBs or CBs. The King Tours have a little more forgiveness and consistency, so he's gonna give them a go this week. We also spotted PGA Tour players testing out new Shrixon, ZX5 MK2 LS, and ZX7 MK2 drivers. They just hit the USGA conforming list this week, so players were free to test them out. And test them out they did. The most noteworthy name making the switch this week was Hideki Matsuyama. We spotted Hideki testing out the new drivers, and he decided on the ZX5 MK2 LS, which we're assuming stands for low spin. Of course, he's equipping the new ZX5 LS with his typical graphite design Tor AD DI 8TX orange shaft. For Mizuno iron lovers, it seems a new JPX Tour 923 iron might be on the way soon. Mizuno staffer Grayson Sig had a bag full of the JPX 923 irons, and we caught an in-hand look at them, showing off what appears to be a slightly different profile at a dress. And even more new product news, Kevin Tway and John Augenstein were spotted testing out a new Wilson Dyna Power Driver, which has carbon all over the crowns and soles. There's also an interchangeable sole weight to help both swing weight and CG. The what's in the bag of the week? Definitely going out to Ryan Moore. As a new equipment free agent, Moore is expressing his freedom to play whatever clubs he wants, and what a bag setup it is. He has a Callaway XR16 Pro 18 degree fairway with a dime size wear mark right in the center of the face. He also has new level irons, including an attack wedge that's part of the set. And he has a classic Titleist Vokey SM4 wedge that's been a cult classic since its retail release in 2011. He then finishes up his bag with a Yes Sandy 12 white mallet putter with C grooves on the face. That's what I like to call a true gamer bag right there. Lastly, a quick shout out to Kramer Hickox Scotty Cameron GSS Proto Putter. It's so clean. And there it is. That was this week's recap from the 2022 Fortinet Championship. A lot of gear news going down, it's probably a lot to take in. Head over to golfwrx.com to see all the photos that me and Greg Moore took from this week. We'll see you over there on golfwrx.com.